Oh, it actually worked. Okay, hello and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Network Transmission. And that one battleship you get from Gutsman is, in fact, what you need to get through here. Uh, I'm gonna... Yep, I knew it. Fuck. Alright, well, anyway, that may have not worked, but, um... You've still got this, and I've got the double jump, so let's try this out right now. And see how useful that is. See how useful that is. Ouch. Uh, alright, get rid. Okay, let's... No, no, let's not screw this up. And let's not run into those spikes, and let's get something that is eh, hopefully useful. High cannon. Okay, not bad, not bad. Pretty swell weapon. Especially this earlier... This early on in the game. Get my double jump ready just in case. And fuck. Uh, oh, oh no, I can still get up here though. Not to worry, not to worry. Still got four double jumps left, and I and I'll still be able to get up there once I, uh, you know, get my double jump. Okay, that didn't work out so well, but I, I, I can still always try again. You know, I still got three more shots, so I mean, not all bad. I, I can still do this. I could I could pull this off. This guy will stop shooting at me. All right. I, I, okay, I, I you know, I'm gonna make a cut here. You know. Okay, finally got it. Yeah, all right, let's see. Ooh, power up. Okay, so it was definitely worth it. Uh, it was a little annoying, but I finally got another power up. So our charge is almost already done. Fully upgraded. Uh, so let's see how fast it charges up. And as you can see, it's much faster than before. Ooh, fell, but not to worry. I'm still here. And, well, my power isn't exactly at its max, so that may be why. It's still not doing that much damage. Um, let's see if I can get over here and get one last thing that I know is here. And it's looking good so far. Oh, that's how you're supposed to do that. Never mind. Um, okay, well, I think that's really all I can do right now. Uh, so I'm gonna leave this area. Alright, if you remember, I said I was gonna come back here with once I got the double jump chip, which I now have. So I'm gonna get this first of all, which uh, has a reg up thing, which may means we can use better chips as our default chips, basically. Um, now I'm gonna go up here because there are a few more. I, I'm just gonna cut to when I get there. Up oh, one right here. All right, let's get let's check this out. Um, HP memory. Okay, that's pretty swell. Increases our total HP. Uh, and one right here, but I think we have to go up here to get that. Yeah. Alright, that took me way too long to find, um, it's actually up here, you just have to go through all these spikes as we've passed them, um, a little difficult to, uh, and, and you know, it's not that difficult to maneuver through, but, uh, anyway, you need to use a double jump to get across here, and I know it looks like you can make it, but you really can't without a double jump, or at least I don't think you can. Um, what the full cost, or whatever it was that I just got does, it just refills your, uh, custom bar. Uh, so it could come in handy in a pinch. Alright, so we're back here, and I'm actually going to take this on again. Now, you're supposed to press A as you're sliding to cancel the slide while you're under one of those spaces, but I'm just going to do this, now that I have the double jump. Like, that's so much easier, and I just and I just realized that I could do that. Like, <laughs> fuck you, Miyamoto. I'm doing it this way. Because Miyamoto obviously had so much to do with the development of this game. Uh, but an HP memory. And that's really all we have to do right here in this area. And... Yeah, so anyway. It's 11 o'clock at night. 11.07 to be exact. Uh, I just finished my homework. And I'm the only person home besides my 8-year-old brother. I think it's a swell time to do some recording. I mean... I can't think of a better way to... Uh, a better time to record than this. All right, don't worry about it. Yay, what's the situation? I know why the computer is malfunctioning. Really? An Abbey? Huh, how'd you know? That's right, exactly. Yeah, it's only like the cause of every single problem in all the Battle Network games. Fucking tag it. Oh my God. Yay, you really piss me off sometimes. No, it's not just yay. It's about every clueless person in the Battle Network series, pretty much. Um, so yes, this is a jungle area. A jungle with trees and grass. Yes, quite. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, you want to have your, um, if you don't already have it, you fucking bird. Oh my god. 
just die. Oh no, I do not like those enemies. I'm not going down there. I'm gonna go down here, because something tells me there's something hidden down here. Like this. Ooh, fire sword. That's always nice. Um, but anyway, as I was saying before, um, what was I saying before? Oh yeah. Um, if you didn't already buy it, it's a little- Ooh! <laughs> oh, and trees and grass and fuck. Alright. Anyway. If you didn't already buy your, uh, what, wood armor, I think it's called wood armor, um, from Higsby's or whatever he's called, it's a little pricey at this point in the game, but, um, if you didn't already buy it for, like, 2,500 zenny, I think, you might want to do that because it will pretty much cut all the damage that you'll take from wood-based enemies, which, um, crowd this area. It'll cut the damage they do in half, so that's definitely a good upgrade to have. And you want to pretty much at one at some point own all of them. Um, I think I'm uh, I try to save up my money so I could buy all of them early on in the game because you really need them. Because uh, the game is hard enough when you have the armors on. Like if you want to play the game at an average difficulty, um, you're gonna need to have those armors. Uh, otherwise, this game is gonna be ridiculous. Oh, those guys! Don't even bother with them. They're insane. Like. They, they look like they're hiding inside these grenade things. Just don't mess with them. Like, you'll hit them with something, and then it won't work on them, and you'll say, oh, well, let me try this. I mean, he's only a little, like, faggot. And then you'll look at your health, and you'll be like, oh. He's already done that much damage. And then you'll just be disappointed in yourself. That happens to me all the time. So just steer clear of those guys. Uh, they look like they're hiding inside of a grenade thing. I don't know. They always seem to give me trouble. I don't know why. Uh, but yes, this is the jungle with, uh, with trees and, and grass. And I've already said this before, but it's going to be my title I actually decided halfway through. Gra grass and trees and fuck. That sounds like a pretty nice title, if I do say so myself. Um... I'm really running low on health right now. Uh, hopefully I bought a sub chip. Nope, nope. I do not have any sort of health recovering sub chip right now or any battle chip that will restore my HP at this moment. I am pretty much royally fucked at this particular moment in time. I, you know, I'm not sure what I'm going to do about this. Uh, I hate when stuff like this happens because I feel like just killing myself to get some HP back. Oh, those white data cube things take note they can be opened with an unlocker um and it contains another power up which is great and uh, <laughs> see see the worst part about that is i almost made it like i grabbed onto the ladder but then i fell off and got killed by that guy but anyway um now i have fully unlocked my char or no fully upgraded my charge ability so you can see how quickly uh mega man will uh, charge up his buster. It really is like a matter of a second or two. More those, more the grenade guy. And I'm getting raped by these spikes. Uh, but luckily I have something to spam to heal myself. Plus I have a full custom bar just in case. You just want to like kind of get with the rhythm here with the uh, with the spikes, or you could just do that once you get to this point. Um, but you really don't want to underestimate the, the damage that the spikes do. Pretty much in just in this game in general, you don't want to underestimate the damage that you're going to take if you just blindly run into enemies just to get past them. It's, you're, you're better off just killing the enemies and then moving on. But anyway, here's the boss. Grab some health. Um, oh, there's something below this. Uh, oh, oh, I really don't want... Oh, oh, double jump ship. Okay, I'll be safe then. In case I miss this, uh, this little drop here. I'll be fine, because I do have zero lives right now, and if you die with zero lives, you get a game over, and you lose, like, save data and stuff, but anyway, right now, I'm gonna jack out, because, um, I don't wanna die, and you can't jack out during a boss fight, so if I were to enter that and find myself hopelessly outmatched, I'd be screwed, so I'm gonna do some grinding and preparing for battle and stuff like that. So I'll cut to when I actually fight Mr. Needleman. All right, so I'm back, and oh, I wasn't even ready for battle. I didn't even get a chance to uh, grab that health power up, but whatever. Let's take on Needleman. Ah! Shut, 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 shut the fuck up! 
Oh, sorry. Sorry, sometimes I do get a little carried away. <laughs> cut, slice, chop, yeah. Plant machines, move, make a sharper design for this garden, cut and slice. Cut it out, Needle Man. No pun intended, Mega Man. What? You? You gonna try and stop me? Don't try any funny business or I'll have to stab you. Why does that... I don't know. Stab me? Really? Are you, are you really gonna stab me, Needle Man? Ah, Mega Man, you gotta stop. Battle routine? Okay. Grammar fail? English? I don't know. I don't even know what to say at this point. Uh, but this is Needle Man, and he is one of the easiest bosses in the game, much like Guts Man. Very, very easy. Um, because he is, uh, you know, he's a wood element type boss, you want to have the wood armor equipped, even though you're probably not even going to get hit that much, and you want to have some fire-based uh, chips to do double damage to him with. Um, I, oh yeah, and I just murdered him. He's dead, so he is really not a hard boss at all. He shouldn't give you any trouble. Um, I probably could have even beaten him uh, without jacking out and going back to grind, but I wanted to get some more battle chips anyway, so... Ah, you guys! What's this? What's going on? Is he back to normal? Maybe. Yay. Is ne Yay. 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 Is Needle Man's operator there? He's here. What should he do? His pet's probably working again. Tell him to jack off right away and turn off the power. J jack off? And he just leaves. Go jack off. You did it. The garden's control computer's back online. Thanks, Lan. Well, Lan, what a relief to get that over and done with. You got that right. The garden seems okay now. Okay, Mega Man, jack off. Gotcha. And so, another segment of the game, or I don't know. I don't know if I'd really call that a segment. I'd call it a part of a segment. Because this whole um, section where we have a bunch of different uh, navvies to take care of, uh, this is all like kind of one segment, I guess. Uh, but anyway, once you save uh, or help Ye out, She'll send you an email, and he'll give you a reward, and that's basically how it works for everyone that you save in this segment. 